Hello students. In this video, we are going to learn regarding adding and subtracting of mixed number, fraction, and as well whole number. Uh, I create this video because some students and parents request me that I have to explain this material, this topic. So I will start with uh, completing a whole number, uh, mixed numbers. All right. Find the missing fractions or mixed number. Number one, two, two over four, plus point, point, point equals five. Okay. So I have to find this, of course, uh, two must be, yeah, five minus two equals three. Okay, five minus two equals three and minus one. Five minus, minus two equals three, minus one equals two. Okay, and after that, writing denominator four. Same with this denominator, okay? And after that, four minus two. Four minus two, how much? Of course, two. So writing two here. So the solution is one, two, two over four. Okay, number two, five minus three equals two. 2 minus 1, 1. Writing denominator, 5. Same as the denominator. And 5 minus 4. This 4. 5 minus 4, how much? Correct, 1. So writing 1 here. This is the solution. 1, 1 over 5. Next is 1. 5 minus 3 equals 2. 2 minus 1. One here, okay, and then writing denominator two, two minus one equals one. This the solution. Next, three two fifth plus point by point equals four. Now four minus three equals one. One minus one equals zero. So no need to writing uh, integers here. So just writing five, okay, because uh, there's no number here because zero, four minus three equals one, one minus uh, one minus one equals zero. So no need to writing uh, integers here, okay. Five, so five minus two equals three. That's the solution. Nine minus three equals six. 6 minus 1, 5. Okay. Writing the denominator, 2. 2 minus 1 equals 1. That's the solution. Next, 5 minus 4, 1. 1 minus 1, 0. So if 0, no need to write in the integers here. Just writing the, the, the fraction, denominator 9. 9 minus 8, 1. That the solution. Let's continue. Completing a whole number, yeah, improper fraction. Okay. Now for uh this question is how to find the solution. For example, just writing for the denominator. Okay. Um, eleven times one equals eleven. And 11 minus 2 equals 9. That's the solution. 9 over 11. Now it's 1. Writing 10. Okay, denominator. 10 times 1 equals 10. 10 minus 8 equals 2. That's the solution. Okay, 10. Uh, 2 over 10, or 
if you want to simplify 10 over 10, 10 uh, 2 over 10, it's going to be 1 fifth. Because 2 divided by 2 equals 1, and 10 divided by 2 equals 5. Okay. That's 1. As usual, write denominator 2. Okay, 2 times 7, 14. 14 minus 11. How much? 3. That's the solution. Okay. 3 half, we may simplify, becomes 1 a half, at least, because 2 times 1 equals 1, 1 plus 1 equals uh, 2 times 2 times 1 equals 2, 2 times 2 plus 1 equals 3. Next, 4. 4 times 5 equals 20. 20 minus 11 equals 9. So the solution is 9 over 4. And we may simplify 9 over 4. Becomes mixed number. Uh, 4. 4 times how much equals 9? 4 times 2. 4 times 2 equals 8. 8 plus 1 equals 9. And then this one, as usual, 5. Get the denominator. 5 times 3, 15. 15 minus 11 equals 4. Okay. We can't simplify 4 over 5. Next one, 4. 4 times 4, 16. 16 minus 10 equals 6. Okay. 6 over 4, we can simplify, becomes 3 half, okay, and it becomes 2 times how much? Times 1. 2 times 1 equals 2, plus 1 equals 3. Okay, that's the solution. 1 half. And next, completing a whole number, mixed number, okay. Same with the previous hour sheet. Okay, now we are going to find a uh, similar with the method same, similar same with the previous uh, hour sheet. 8 minus 7 equals 1. 1 minus 1 equals 0. So we need to, we need to write the integers in front the fraction, just denominator 3, 3 minus 2 equals 1. That's the solution. That's 1. 10 minus 8 equals 2. 2 minus 1 equals 1. So writing 1 here in front of fraction. So writing 2 and 2 minus 1 equals 1 here. That's the solution. Now, 3 minus 2 equals 1. 1 minus 1 equals 0. So, no need to write in just in front of fraction. Just writing 7. Okay, 7 minus 2 equals 5. That's the solution. So, this one. 2 minus 1 equals 1. 1 minus 1 is 0. So, no need to write in. Uh, in just in front of this fraction. So, 11. 11 minus 7 equals 4. Okay. 4 minus 2 equals 1. I'm sorry. So 4 minus 2 equals 2. 2 minus 1 equals 1. Okay. Always minus 1. Okay. So 4 minus 2 equals 2. 2 minus 1 equals 1. And then denominator 3. 3 minus 1. This one equals 2. So the solution 1, 2 third. 2 minus 1 equals 1. 1 minus 1 equals 0. So we need to write things number here in front of fraction. Just writing denominator 10. 10 minus 9 equals 1. Next. Subtracting fraction from whole numbers. Okay. Now look at this. 7 minus uh, 5 over 6. Uh, it becomes 6 plus 1 minus 5 over 6. 
Okay. So it becomes six. And six times one equals six. Minus five equals one. So it be one here and six denominator. That's the solution. After that, this one. And eight plus one minus 23 over 25 equals 8. 25 times 1 equals 25 minus 23 equals 2. 2 over 25. This is the solution. That's 1. 9, 8 plus 1 minus 5 over 7. equals 8, 7 minus 5 equals 2, 2 over 7, okay, this one, 8 plus 1 minus 94 over 100, it's going to be 8, 100 minus 24 equals 6, 6 over 100. Okay, and you may simplify becomes becomes 8, 3 over 50, because you divide by 2. Okay. Next, 17, 16 plus 1, minus 42 over 50, it becomes 16, 50 times 1, 50, minus 42 equals 8 over 50, and you may simplify become 16 divided by 2, 4 over 25, it's 1, 8, plus 1, minus 3 fifths, plus 8, 5 times 1, 5, minus 3, equals 2. So the solution, 8, 2 fifths. That's 1. This worth it. The last worth it. 8 minus 5, equals 3. 3 minus 1, equals 2. Two, okay. And next, 16, 16 minus 10 equals 6. Okay, and we may simplify becomes 2, 3 over 5, because divided by 2. Next, 10 minus 9 equals 1, 1 minus 1, 0. So zero, it means no need to writing number in front of fraction, just the denominator 12. 12 minus 9 equals 3. And then simplify, divide by 3, what? Divide by 3, 4. Okay. 11 minus 10, 1. 1 minus 1 equals 0. So no need to writing number in front of fraction. Just 50 minus 34, 17. I sorry, 16. 16 over 50. And if I buy 2 equal 8 over 25. This is the solution. And this one, 7 minus 3 equals 4. 4 minus 1 equals 3. Okay. And then the Denominator 20, 20 minus 8 equals 12. Okay, and simplify 3. Divide by 4. 3 over 5. Okay, 3 is 3 fifth. 7 minus 5, 2. 2 minus 1 equals 1. And then 6 
6 minus 5 equals 1, that's the solution. 8 minus 3 equals 5. 5 minus 1 equals 4. Okay. 2 and 2 minus 1 equals 1. That's the solution. Okay, students, thank you for joining with me in this lesson. Don't forget to click subscribe. See you.